Have you ever heard that you should add 7 sixteenths of an inch to jack rafters when using a Construction Master Pro? Here's how it works. If you deduct half the thickness of the ridge for a 2 by ridge, that's 3 quarters of an inch. Adding 7 sixteenths is intended to get the long point lengths, but the calculator gives the center line length, which is another 3 quarters inch shortening to the run when using 2 by stock. So adding that 3 quarters of an inch to the earlier one brings us to an inch and a half. But there is also a run deduction for a half the 45 degree thickness of the hip or valley, which is 1 and 1 16th of an inch. And if we find the difference between this inch and a half and 1 and 1 16th of an inch, you're left with 7 16ths of an inch to make up for and why many framers just add 7 16ths to their jacks. You may have noticed that this is all based on plan view dimensions, which makes 7 sixteenths a good estimate for lower pitches, but is less accurate for steeper roofs. For example, I've calculated out the long point jack length for a 3 inch pitch using a longer but more accurate method, and the difference between that value and the 7 sixteenths shortcut was essentially zero. For a 12 inch pitch, the shortcut is off by almost a quarter of an inch, and on a 24 inch pitch, it's off by over half an inch. So it is a good shortcut, but only on shallow pitched regular hips and valleys using 2 by stock.